Cindy Janice with the latest. Two shark attacks on Florida beaches in just one day. Friday afternoon, a 19-year-old woman swimming in waist-deep water in New Smyrna Beach bitten on the foot. At first she was a little freaked out. She suffered only minor injuries. Roughly an hour later, 65 miles south at Cocoa Beach, a 14-year-old girl wading in the ocean attacked, her foot more severely injured. And less than a week ago on that very same beach, 13-year-old Alyssa Wetro was also bitten in shallow water. The pain, like a sharp pain, went in that, and then I pulled my foot up, and that's when I saw it all bleeding. Florida is the shark attack capital of the world, with most incidents on the East Coast. But beachgoers on the state's Gulf Coast on high alert, too, after this shark was filmed just last month swimming near a residential community. And across the country in California, this juvenile great white right alongside a sheriff's boat. A flyby of the same area spotting at least six more sharks swarming the water, some up to six feet long. A recent report says their population has increased by an estimated 42 percent since the late 1990s, partly because of a federal ban on hunting them. Shark attacks are still rare and fatalities even more so. But last month in Hawaii, the first dipped her foot more severely injured. And less than a week ago on that very same beach, 13-year-old Alyssa Wetro was also bitten in shallow water. The pain, like a sharp pain, went in that. And Cindy Janice with the latest. Two shark attacks on Florida beaches in just one day. Friday afternoon, a 19-year-old woman swimming in waist-deep water in New Smyrna Beach bitten on... And I pulled my foot up, and that's when I saw... It all bleeding. Florida is the shark attack capital of the world, with most incidents on the East Coast. But beachgoers on the state's Gulf Coast on the foot. At first she was a little freaked out. She suffered only minor injuries. Roughly an hour later, 65 miles south at Cocoa Beach, a 14-year-old girl wading in the ocean attacked on high alert too. After this shark was filmed just last month swimming near a residential community. And across the country in California, this juvenile great white 